cannot remember everything. I must have been unconscious most of the time. I remember only the grandiose moment when they all started to sing as if prearranged. The old prayer they had neglected for so many years. The forgotten creed. I have no recollection how I got underground to live in the sewers of Warsaw for so long a time. The day began as usual. We pray when it still was dark. Get out, whether you slept or whether worries kept you awake the whole night. You had been separated from your children, from your wife, from your parents. You don't know what happened to them. How could you sleep? Come with the cane. Get out. The sergeant will be furious. They came out, some very slowly. The old ones, the sick ones, some with nerves of jealousy. They fear the sergeant. They hurry as much as they can. In vain. Much too much noise. Much too much commotion. And not fast enough. The feld will shout. Achtung! Still standen! Da wird's voll! Oder soll ich mit dem Gewehr folgen nachhelfen? Na gut! Wenn ich's durchaus haben wollt! The sergeant and his subordinates hit everyone. Young or old, strong or sick, guilty or innocent. It was painful to hear the groaning and moaning. I heard it though I had been hit very hard. So hard that I could not help falling down. We all on the ground who could not stand up were then beaten over the head. have been unconscious. The next thing I heard was a soldier saying, they are all dead. Whereupon the sergeant ordered to do away with us. There I lay aside, half conscious. It had become very strange. Fear and pain. Then I heard the sergeant shouting, Abtenen! They started slowly and irregularly. One, two, three, four. Abtenen! The sergeant shouted again, Asha! Nochmals von vorn anfangen! In einer Minute will ich wissen, wie viel ich von Gaskammer abliefere! Abzählen! They began again. First slowly. One, two, three, four. We came faster and faster, so fast that it finally sounded like a stampede of wild horses. And all of a sudden, in the middle of it, they began 